The Environment Agency are working in partnership with Eastbourne Borough Council to develop a new large-scale coastal flood and erosion risk management project with big investment over the next 100 years. The project is called the Pevensey Bay to Eastbourne Coastal Management Scheme. The Pevensey Bay to Eastbourne coastline is in East Sussex on the south-east coast of England. The project will make an estimated 10,000 residential properties as well as key infrastructure, local businesses, heritage sites and nature conservation areas more resilient to flooding. With sea levels predicted to rise by more than a metre over the next 100 years, along with an increase in storms, the climate emergency and sea level rise are critical issues this coastline is facing in the future. The project will be looking at how we can adapt to the future coastal conditions. We will be looking at how the coastline can adapt and become more resilient to coastal flooding in the future and to provide protection to communities at risk and the environment. We have funding secured to develop the initial ideas for the scheme. The coastline from Pevensey Bay to Eastbourne is currently managed as two separate areas. Eastbourne Borough Council managed the section from Hollywell to Langley Point and the Environment Agency managed the defences from Sovereign Harbour to Coudham Beach through a contract with Pevensey Coastal Defences Limited. This project will be bringing the two areas together to manage as one as they are both within the same flood cell. Did you know the Shingle Beach is the flood defence for a large section of this coastline? The beach is used for recreation but also protects properties from flooding. This defence is managed by moving the shingle on the beach to provide the level of protection needed. As part of this scheme, we will be looking at different ways to protect the coastline and adapt to climate change. To do this, we are looking to work with nature to provide more sustainable and climate-friendly flood solutions. We will be exploring opportunities to create different types of marine and intertidal habitat, which offer opportunities to more resilience to flooding in unison with improving biodiversity and reducing our carbon footprint. As part of the project's design for increased flood protection, there are opportunities to incorporate improvements to the public realm. We want to work with you to understand what you would like to see. This could include, for example, improved accessibility, creating creative spaces and recreation areas, we're looking to work with you to maximise these opportunities. We're at the early stages of the project and are doing a number of different site investigations, modelling and surveys to get a better understanding of the current defences and wider environment. These investigations will help to inform some options for the future. At all stages of this project, we want to work with you to shape the scheme. We want to understand how you use the coastline, what you value and how you would like to use it in the future. Through the scheme, we will be engaging with you to gather your feedback on the future of this coastline. For all the latest updates, please visit the project website or you can join the mailing list by emailing us.